will now go over the shim bed level and utility. For this utility, we will need a scraper, a glue stick, our plastic leveling shim, our fiber leveling shim, and a two and a half millimeter hex key. Before performing any bed leveling procedure, we will want to make sure we thoroughly clean our print bed to remove any glue residue. I would also like to note, if we are switching between print beds, we will more than likely need to run the Adjust Z Offset utility to be able to properly level the bed. Also, I'd like to point out it is recommended that we run the bed level test print routine every time we shim bed level. You may need to perform multiple shim levels slash test print cycles before the bed is completely level. To begin our leveling process, we will navigate to the shim bed level utility. Select menu, bed level, shim bed level. Be sure to heed the warning about putting pressure on the print bed during the leveling process and then press next. At this point, we want to ensure that we have both brass leveling shims from our accessory kit and then hit next. You will then loosen each of the three thumb screws below the print stage to its lowest point and press next. However, we want to be careful not to over loosen the thumb screws as they may fall out of the print stage and can be very difficult to reinstall. When prompted, slide the plastic shim between the print bed and the nozzle and press next. We will then adjust the thumb screw until we feel a slight resistance on the shim. Once we have that slight resistance, we will press next. We are going to now repeat this process for each of the other two thumb screws, as prompted by the utility. If this is your first time running the shim bed level utility, you may need to repeat this process several times to develop a sense of the right amount of resistance. After completing this process for the third thumb screw, when prompted by the utility, slide the plastic shim between the plastic nozzle and the print bed to verify the tension over the first thumb screw has not changed. If you no longer feel a slight resistance on the shim, the print bed is not level. In that case, adjust the thumb screw until you feel slight resistance on the shim, then press retry to adjust the other two thumb screws. However, if you do still feel a slight resistance, we're going to simply press next. Now, we will slide our fiber shim between the fiber nozzle and the print bed and hit next. As prompted, we're going to use our 2.5mm hex key to adjust the fiber nozzle height until we feel a slight resistance on the fiber shim, just like we did with the plastic nozzle and plastic shim. Once you feel a slight resistance on the fiber shim, we will want to double check the resistance on both the plastic and fiber shims at this point. If we still have a slight resistance on both shims, we're going to press run test print to verify that our bed is level or select skip if we wish to exit the utility. If you do not feel a slight resistance, select retry and re-level your print bed.